My cat and rat. My cat just sits there, covering the mat. All the snacks have made him quite fat. We had to do something, so outside we dash to the pet shop with a handful of cash. Got a rat, all hairy and black, and brought him home in a big raggy sack. But now that rat and my cat just sit there, covering the mat. Ten eggs. So sleepy I have to be led up the stairs and off to bed. Open the door and put up my leg right next to a little red egg. A nest in my room but I don't know when. It became a home for that little red hen. I woke up early, feeling my neck. It was the little hen giving it a peck. I sit up and look under the hen. Where there was one egg, there are now ten. My pet pig. My pet pig is getting big. She loves to dance with a twig. As she dances oh so quick, she hits my lip with that stick. Spins around, it's a very good trick, but gives my shin one big kick. As I sit and rub my skin, I have to let out a little grin. At times like this, I always wish that my pet pig was just a fish. Smelly socks. Smelly socks smell like rot. You must drop them like they're hot. Flop them, drop them in a shop. But that smell, you must stop. Leave them out and they make fog. The smell alone will make you jog. Put them in a box and lock. The smell alone will give you shock. As you turn green, just like a frog, Mum has an idea. Give them to the dog. A bug hug. If bugs could hug, would you run? Or open your arms and have some fun? Six long legs in that hug, I think would make you pretty snug. If it was a spider, I don't think so fun, as in his web you could be spun. Lots of sticky silk is yucky. To get out of this, you have to be lucky. Stuck in here could make you glum. But to get out, why not just shout, Mum? <laughs>